Hello, dear friend. My name is Wao Zhou. I'm a sales engineer from Shenzhen Huidu Technology. This video, I will show you how to use Huidu Technology Synchronous Controller HD VP210. As we know, VP210 is a live controller for LED wall. Firstly, let's show you the input port of VP210 controller. It supports a USB input for directly playing video or picture, and the HDMI, HDMI video, and the CVBS from camera or TV box, and the VGA and the DVI input for video, and it also supports audio in and output. And this this USB is to configure the LED receiver with your computer. And uh, it's also with Wi-Fi port for mobile application control. For output, VP, VP210 with 2 gigabit Ethernet output port. OK, next, I will show you how to connect the LED receiver and our LED modules. This LED wall with two LED cabinets. Each cabinet with one air, one receiver, and uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, five lights of LED modules. For light one, each each LED module connects with the flat table one by one. And for the first for the first LED module, we use long cable to connect with the first output of the LED receiver and then the second uh, second port of the LED receiver connects with the, the second line of the LED module then port, one, port 3 to line 3 port 4 to line 4 so each port to one line of the cabinet And each receiver with two gigabit Ethernet port. One port with a LAN cable connect connect with another receiver. And the first uh, first LED, first receiver is connect with one cable connect with our VP210. We can we first use the output connect with the, the first uh, output port of VP210, and we connect the power cable of VP210. Next, we use the HDMI cable to connect the input port of VP210. And another side connect with our computer. Last step, we we need to use the USB USB cable to connect with our computer and the, the VP210. This cable is we use to configure the VP210 through our computer. Next, we power on VP210 and the, also the LED screen. Now, as you can see, the display, the display of the LED screen is not, is not right because we did not configure the LED screen. Now we need to use the HD set software to configure the LED receiver and also the VP210. Firstly, we click uh, to we double click to open the HD set software and uh, choose VP uh, VP210 and uh, click uh, screen configura configuration. Firstly, we need to click receiving card 
parameters. We can we can load in the configuration file from the load file we, we, we are including in the software we can all we can do smart setting to configure the LED modules. We choose the module width and choose drive IC and the decoding chip. Next, choose the color of the LED screen. Next, choose how many lights on on one module. Follow the flash, mo flash pointer on the LED modules and also clean the diagram. Look at the screen. The flash pointer also is moving. It go goes to line 1. So we also come to line 1. Let's clean one by one to light on the whole modules. Finish smart setting. Now we need to do the display con connection setting. We have two cards connect with port one. The resolution of one cabinet is one one hundred and sixty pixel by 160 pixel. And the first receiver is on the right when we view from the front side. So the first, first receiver is on the right, right side. Now, you can see the display is right now. Now we need to adjust the re refresh rate. To make uh, the LED warp performance better. Now, the configuration of the LED screen is finished. And uh, my desktop is uh, synchronous with uh, the LED screen. But as you can see, only part of my desktop is showing on the display. If we need to show the full desktop, we need to clean the button on the VP210 front panel. We clean the scalar. Then the desktop will zoom in. We connect with a different video, like v DVI, DVI, VGA. We can click uh, the corresponding button to switch different video resource. We can switch to DVI, VGA, CVBS, or USB. Next, let's show you how to use uh, our HD show player to play live video. First, let's double click to open HD software. This is our few professional player for live video. We create a new project and uh, click to add a resource field like video and put the video on the screen. We can add more resource like a uh, clock, countdown, and the digital clock, and the playlist. Also, network media or website. That's all. Thank you.